respect and keep her all the days of your life. Courtney, do you take this man to be your wedded husband? I do. And do you promise to love and honor, respect and keep him all the days of your life? I do. Then let us all bow in prayer. O Lord of life and love, we ask that you bestow thy grace upon this marriage and seal this commitment of thy children with thy love. We lift up Michael and Courtney to you right now, and we pray you give them courage and strength to live up in the sacred vows that they are taking here today. We pray these in your name, Jesus, our Lord and Savior. Give our eternal life. Amen. This time I ask you to turn and face each other. Hold on to each other's hands. Look into each other's eyes. Michael, ask me first, repeat after me to Courtney. I'm Michael. Take you, Courtney, for my wife. I promise you, I will never leave you. I will love you and trust you all the days of my life. In sickness and in health. For richer or for poorer. For better or for worse. Forever and ever. And I'll be thankful to God that he gave me you. Courtney, you'll do the same as you repeat after me to Michael. I, Courtney, take you, Michael, for my husband. I promise you, I will never leave you. I will love you and trust you all the days of my life. In sickness and in health. For richer, for richer or for poor, for better, for better or for worse, for worse, forever and ever. And I'll be thankful to God that he gave me you. Michael and Courtney, this is a day to celebrate. It's a day to rejoice. It's a day to be honored year after year. It's your wedding day. It's May 19th in the year 2016. You're here at the Dwight Wedding Chapel in Las Vegas, Nevada in front of the altar of marriage. Always remember today you marry your friend, the one you laugh with, the one you dream with, the one you live for, and especially the one you love. To enjoy the success of your marriage, remember the three C's. First is Christ, second is commitment, third is communication. For any relationship or commitment that is God-based, God-focused, and puts God first and never fail. But God is joined together, let no man separate. May God bless you and keep you. May make his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. And as a minister of the gospel by the authority of God, by the power vested in me by the state of Nevada, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Michael, you may kiss your <laughs> Well, they did it. They did it. They did it. <laughs> Make a Superman. I'm the witness guy. <laughs> Got it all on video, guys. Oh, my goodness. Lovely. Yay. Yay. Yes, I know my hair is going to get caught in there. We'll come over here.